Hey guys, so it is Sunday. Dustin here, Jessica, and we're gonna do another order poll just because we wanna get stuff out all, basically every day for the next few days because even though it's past the USPS ground advantage deadline, stuff can still get to people by Christmas and people are still probably ordering under the assumption they'll get it by Christmas. I and mean, we want people to have happy Christmases. Merry Christmases. Yes. <laughs> so we're also going to get into what we're going to be doing about eBay and they're pulling down our listings in just a moment. But again, we're gonna get this order pull portion knocked out. Then I'm gonna run down and edit. I was thrifting earlier today. She was taking a, a half day. I took pictures all morning. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We do need a day it's off though. Time, yeah. A vacation? No, a day off. Baby steps. Okay, there's no PTO. All right, you, you had PTO in your last job and you gave it up. Cause I took PTO to do this. Duck decoys have been a staple of the Pro Picker channel for quite some time. Uh, actually, I remember when I first started the channel, I was out thrifting all the time. He signed. And I was out thrifting all the time, and I'd run into something duck related in almost every video for like a m couple months, three months straight. It was nuts. She picked this up at a thrift store for oh, just a couple dollars, five bucks, I think. So that's pretty good. $39.99, free shipping and on that one. If you recall from the last video, we sold that giant goose, which, which is no longer up there. used to live there, yeah. but now lives in a postal bin somewhere. <laughs> the Jeep bag, oh, um. What's up, did you move the Jeep bag? It wouldn't be over here. Um, it, it's, it's been here, it's in, a, it's in a bin because I remember you saying something yeah. about it. Um. I just don't remember which bin. So skip So I got this that. Jeep duffel bag. And I think I got this garage sale and, mm -hmm. and it was like really cheap. But anyways, we did also get uh, these jeans. They're in 28, which is like way over here. I'll follow you. These are American Eagle jeans. I have no clue where these came from, honestly. But they are right here. I doubt we have anything more than a dollar into these. $18.99. I don't recommend buying the brand, by the way. I, I don't know how. American Eagle. Yeah. Oh, I, um, I think that came in that thread up box or something like oh, that. Oh, that might. Oh, yeah, I, I forget that thread up box even happened. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. Okay. I wouldn't recommend sourcing this, though, like out in the wild. Like, especially like thrift store jeans are five and six bucks. Yeah. Or more, depending on your region. 130 Griswold. So this is one, I, is this the one we just recently picked up? Uh, yes. Don't tell them then, because we can't keep spoiling these pro picker videos. So don't look, close your eyes. Oh! We got this Griswold for an undisclosed amount of money. <laughs> you can see it's Griswold there on the base. On the bottom, yep. Number eight. We sold this for $79.99. It's heavy too. Those cast iron pans are hard to hold with like one hand. We got a St. Nicholas Square grandmother's house. I picked this up out thrifting very recently. Uh, there was another St. Nicholas Square and I actually comped it and it was like sub $30. And this kind of box like that, I just didn't want to deal with. I think I have six bucks, maybe four bucks under this. $39.99. We've got uh, Bengals, new era cap, 39.30. Bengals doing pretty well again, so the Bengals merch is moving again. And this sold for $14.99, not a heavy hitter or anything, but it sold. We also... Oh, another um, Dark Tower. Yeah. So that'll take a second to pull out. It's a figure. It is... Um, tan miniature figure he's like holding it up in the air that that's guy? the one so this little figure here sold for 16.99 free shipping but i mean let's be honest we baked that shipping in um this is gonna be on my phone screen till we get rid of it that full hearted broken dreams that we sold see last video 
So let's do media run real quick here. It'll be quick. So we got Spider Man. His S should be right here. Spider Man friend or foe on the Wii. Complete. Fourteen ninety nine. We sold a mercenary, which I can't tell you guys any of the background of this. So I have footage of acquiring. You guys can't see all that. It's way too <laughs> much oh, of a spoiler. I mean, it's too much. I have the footage, but I don't know where I put it, which is annoying. 3DO game here, a mercenary, and that sold for $9.99. Xbox Halo 2. I was like, uh... How many Halo 2s do we have? Okay, so ours is... Okay, so just give me a second to like... There's Halo 2, then there's nothing, then there's Halo 2, then there's another Halo 2. This has no manual on the inside. And it has a white box sticker on the inside. <laughs> this is probably it. That one. Okay. So we sold, that was worth it, $9.99. We sold Halo 2, $9.99 there. Uh, somebody asked if we sub -skew. We sometimes have in the past where we'll put like A, B, C, D, or yeah. a random word or something. Like these right there, yeah. Yeah, but. Sometimes often, you forget though, or like I forget to do forgetting. it. It's not even forgetting, it's just that you're trying to bust through. Like we're trying to get so many things listed. You got both of us picturing, so that can kind of change the system sometimes. And with so many games, it's hard to remember that you have. Innocent Man Vinyl. Um, while you grab that, because our vinyl setup is better than it was, it still has progress to be made. Watch, you'll grab it instantly, because I said that. I'm going to grab this book here. It's a Fallout 3 Prima Guide. This is hardcover, and it's $39.99, and I think it's not that one. It's this one, so it's a fancy one behind all these paperbacks here. And yeah, this sold for 40 bucks, guys. Pretty awesome. And then, this Billy Joel there, I think $12.99? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Then we have something out of this small big. Oh. Um, yeah, it's at uh, Trend Masters right there. Is it this guy? Yeah, probably. Is it Godzilla. King of... The Monsters. The Monsters, Ghidorah, yep. yeah. So that sold for twenty eight forty nine. I think we sent out an offer to get that sale. Continuing to look here, but that's probably it. Yeah, I think that's it. I don't know why it says fourteen. It doesn't feel like fourteen items, but it is. Okay, I guess that's why it says fourteen. All right, so we're gonna take these back over to the table real quick, guys. I'm going to place these over here. All right, so I've got the chest mount on here. We're going to go do something. We're going to try, try and start breaking this work up in little segments and chunks. So eBay's been taken down in listings. I think they, they, I think, just disappeared into the ether because of, like, technical issues. It's not, like, a Vero violation. It's not, you should, you're not allowed to list this. There are obvious things that you're obviously able to list that we've been noticed uh, being taken down. And so this has kind of been a series of events over the last few days. And I don't really like our money getting messed with. So we're going to start here. And I think what we'll do is, like, let's start in small chunks. The PS2 is, like, I don't even know. I mean, that's where we found that we had the issues. So I, I know that we have one issue in the 007 that you're touching right now. Okay, if we go ahead and take this stuff down and we'll take it over to the table and go through okay. the fact that this even has to be done. Okay, so I mean, we can always come back and get more. <laughs> You're like, let's take the whole shelf at one time. Well, no. Like, we'll, well, this is a row of stuff where we own multiples. Okay, so we're going to take this over here to the computer. We're going to go to a screen that doesn't have customer information, which is the uh, store. 
So she'll load up the store real quick. Then we'll close out all the other tabs too. Well, I'm gonna just go ahead and do this. Yeah, I get the big monitor up here. Our fancy Samsung monitor from Sam's Club from years ago has been repurposed. The main reason we have this screen uh, down here is because it's so great for the whatnot shows. Um, so. Okay, so here's what I would say. Yeah, well, let's start alphabetically. So we'll start from uh, Agent Under Fire and see how many of those we have listed. Under, this is probably enough. We have three, so we have three, we're good. But we have three black labels and I have two black labels and a greatest hits. Well, you could have a 007 and a James Bond, so one second. That means we probably have James Bond alphabetized as J or something. Further N. So, no, because that would make sense. That happened. So that sounds like an error on our part. So we're going to want to take down the one that's unlisted and then put the other one in the take a picture pile. Okay, we move this here because standing concrete's fun. This one's not listed? That one's not listed. Well, we'll make a pile here. But then let me also take down the red label. Yes. The greatest hits. Okay. So next we're gonna go with um, iToy Anti-Grav, which you just have uh, Anti-Grav. What's that listed? 899? Mm -hmm. Comp that real quick. There's no way that that's worth uh, having listed. I'm just, there's, there's no way. What's that sell for these days? Seven fifty. Oh, that's complete. Anti grab is the one with the guy it's doing like that. Five. Yeah. Five. Oh, keep going more. Five dollars free ship. Okay, so we're gonna take this down because this will never sell for anything that's acceptable, and we're gonna put it over there to whatnot, and liquidate it. Liquidate. So that can go over here. We have a new task that Jess doesn't know coming up of getting this whatnot together today. Huh. It's like, it's like. These are the things we just two? sold. So these. Oh, okay. Backyard baseball. Backyard basketball. That's what I mean. Okay. Um, $8.99. Comp that too. So we're gonna call, cause I mean, there's no point, like valuable stuff can go on that shelf. And I don't think that's worth $8.99 shipped anymore or if it was it was during the spike or something it's not the list and we're gonna take this as an opportunity to purge at least the games so well, far. i mean <laughs> if we could do this out of every fade cabela's dangerous hunts does not feel like one that's worth is a disc only da dangerous hunts two but you have one of one Hunt 6.99 uh it's a ski list of Outdoor Adventures. I feel like this is getting targeted too. This is not exactly what I expected to be doing, but. 7 a.m. Just delist it. That's not the only thing you're going to see. In, we put premium, premium stuff in our whatnot shows too, so don't worry. Finest Hour, we should have two of those plus a combo pack. Finest hour, finest hour. I believe that to be worth 10 bucks shipped. Okay, then we got uh, the Com Call of Duty Legacy. Give me the... Uh... Call of Duty Legacy is unlisted. Um, give me these. I'll put these over here. Oh, okay, good, good. Uh, Conflict Desert Storm. I doubt that's even worth it, but... It could be $10 shipped. Conflict Desert Storm. Nine Ninety nine. Search the comp on that because that's that sounds high. And that's a game I used to pitch, but I mean things have changed. Seven ninety nine. Nine oh it's black label. Which is better. Okay. That's fine. It's listed. Uh yes. Okay, next is Crash Tag Team Disc Only. I buy that. It's okay. Bucks? Probably. Uh Crash uh Wrath of Cortex. Listed. Okay. Dark Cloud. Listed. 
Sounds right. Okay. Can I have those that are listed? Because you're putting them in piles. So they're not the right piles. Oh, no. I think we've got... This, these two Conflict so far. Conflict Desert Storm was... Is, uh, is listed. Oh, is listed. Is yeah. Listed. Okay. So, we have Dead to Rights. Yeah. Greatest hits? Yeah. Good opening. Dead to Rights, uh, non-greatest hits. Manual. Mm, got it. Okay. Then we've got Destroy All Humans. Complete. Greatest Hits. And a Destroy All Humans Black 2. Greatest Hits. And then two, two. Black Label. Done. Uh, Devil May Cry. I don't even know why I'm looking at discs. Uh, yep, yes. You're good. Uh, Tenkaichi. Is this one? I can't spell that. Dragon Ball. Just put Dragon Ball in. In one word. And it's, we don't have a lot of DBZ stuff up. I guess we do. But not that much to where... Place the, uh... Tenkaichi 1. That may... It, that we bought this around the same time. No? So it's not listed. So this goes over here. That's like a $25 game. We got Fairly Odd Parents. Nope. Not listed. Really? Yep. Uh, Fight Night Round 3. We have two of them. Black Label. Okay. We've got Finding Nemo. Greatest Hits. Greatest Hits. We've got The Getaway. We've got Ghost Recon. I got a lot of Ghost Recon. Uh, this plain Ghost Recon. It's got the silver side here. That's it right this there. This one? A $6.99 D-list. It is that one, right? Oh, we have a Greatest Hits as well. It's that one. We also have a Greatest Hits of that. Okay, so Ghost Recon, this is this one. How much is it? $7.99, so like four. And then we have two. We have like three, okay. And then we have Ghost Recon 2. And that one. We have two Ghost Recons. Do you see the ones that we, I don't know what two goes for. Ghost Recon 2. I'm gonna purge oh, wait. these. These are the ones that you just, these are Ghost Recon. Yes. I just took one of these down and I just took these two down. Okay, and then we have this. We have a third one then. And then we have this. Ghost Recon. Game of the Year. That's, this That's one. the one. Take this down. Yeah, because they're not selling and haven't forever. Ghost Recon 2. Ghost Recon 2. Black Label. Right there. Yep. Take it down. Yeah, we're going to get rid of that. And these are going to go over to whatnot, and we will start them cheap or put them in the Buy It Now section, so if people need them. That's Advanced Warfighter. Advanced Warfighter I have is eleven ninety nine. That's probably worth it. And then Jungle Storm. Ghost Recon Jungle Storm. Yes. I should have a black label Warfighter. You already. I have two. Well, you have another Warfighter. What do you mean, Advanced Warfighter? Yeah. That is a black label Advanced Warfighter. Well, I have two listed here. Oh, that's oh, the PSC. Yeah. Bad, my bad. And then we have Jungle Storm. Jungle which, Storm. That goes. Yeah. That stays. Uh, God of War, which absolutely uh, is fine to let, keep listed because that's a seller. God of War collection. We don't have it. This, so this is unlisted. So this right here is a game that sells pretty quickly. Not for a ton of money, but pretty quickly, usually. And it's been delisted by eBay. Okay. So I've got Grand Theft Auto. Okay, we're on PlayStation 2. Mm -hmm. i got a GTA Vice City. With, two with map we've got just a vice city which uh, i need to see but for some reason it it's loaded. showing the stock photo yeah. so you're gonna have to click over okay is it only one vice city that you have we have indigo subskew vice city i have vice city indigo okay so that's listed that's listed uh, chuck that over there please this is not um that must be this one with map this with map. is but with I'm map. End it because, oh, then actually, we're, we're gonna put it in the relist and just repicture it. Yeah. Because nobody's yeah. gonna buy that stock photo one. Yeah. And then we have the Vice City double pack. In this case, scroll down a little. Is it that? No, that's three. This is unlisted. Okay. We've got uh, Guitar Hero three A and B. 
I have A, B, and C. I have A and B so far. Oh, I mean, C is oh, still on the shelf. Maybe. Oh, we have Grand Theft Auto 3 double pack. And then we have... Hold on. I'm going to see if C is on the shelf. It's in the next section, right? C. Yeah, C is. But you don't have Device City? Uh, just asking. No. Hmm. So these are, these are good. So this is A, B. And then we need to check oh, wait, these two. Arrow, Aerosmith. I have A, B, C, and there's Aerosmith right there. Jack two. And then Jack. Jack two, greatest hits. Listed. Listed. Okay, so these need to go to the list area, and these these that she has need to go back to the DVD shelf. Which, honestly, the next time we take it a big game lot, we're going to have purged some of the stuff to whatnot that have room for better inventory. And, and those will get relisted over there. That Call of Duty double pack's pretty decent, I think. I guess we can just... Oh, do you want to keep at these right now? Well, if we're going to do a section... Just do all the PS2? Do all the PS2. Well, I'm talking for like, are you guys getting bored? Oh. <laughs> we can probably cut this um, down quite a bit. Wow. Guitar Hero World Tour. It's working hard over here, drinking my Duncan. That's good. Harry Potter Goblet. Just put in Harry Goblet. Harry Potter Goblet. Good. Incredibles. It's the greatest hits. $9.99. That sounds wrong. I doubt that game's worth ten dollars. So let's double check it, please. That's brand new. That's not right. A buck. Uh, couple bucks. That's new other. Seven. That new other's tricking people, I bet. Just delist yeah. just delist it. I mean, it's one of those games I think is probably worth enough. Somebody would want it. Guys, if you have things that you need to fill in in your video game collection, we're going to blow out a lot of this. So on whatnot, like it, it'll be cheap. So if you're like trying to, uh, if you're crazy and trying to have every PS2 game, <laughs> you're going to want to be at our show. Lord of the Rings, Two Towers. You always... Two Towers, PS2. How much you have that at? Currently on sale for $18.99. Uh, market. Let's comp that because, like, honestly, I think we're high. It's a good game, but we're, it's not, I mean, they made a quadrillion of them. Complete black Complete label. Complete black label. Nine bucks. About 15. 15? No, not get down to 15. 15 uh, free. Shipping. Mm, it's part of a sale that I can't change the price. I'm going to write it down. If you take it down and relist it. Yeah, I can do that. So just give it to me for a relist pile. Max Payne. I figure if we're going to do this calling, we might as well make it count. Do it right and get it from all approaches. You know, price adjustments. Max, yeah, I got that. You know, we're going to make it worth, worth our time. What's going to whatnot. So Metal Gear Solid 2? Yeah, Sons of Lib 2. Put two in there. I only have five Metal oh, Gear Solid. Okay. So, well, we need three black labels and one red. I got one red. Okay. I got one black. Um, two black. Sons of Liberty? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I was like, why is there blue? Yeah, so I have, I have three blacks and a red. So you're good on yeah. this? Okay. That's good. Then we've got Medal of Honor, Frontline, and Rising Sun. This, these are games I'm suspect on the value. Rising Sun, Frontline. I really don't think they're worth ten bucks a piece. That's why we still have them. Yeah, take them down. Oh, I look at the. I need to look at it though. I really don't. The pair. Oh, I would like to do that. Okay. So, so take it take down, down, and then we're going to. Uh, list them together. I'm going to put them in a bag. A, let's put these tape, little tape, that's fine. 
Well, they're gonna get in a plastic bag eventually, anyways. But that's I think fine. I might just tape them together like that in the. Put them alphabetically. Yeah. MX versus ATV <laughs> Unleashed. Hold on. <laughs> this is totally not worth having up. Let's uh, let's see. I don't think it is up. Okay, it's going into whatnot. MBA 07 the life. Which I have no clue if this is worth it. Oh, it's got Kobe on the front. Yeah, 10 bucks. 10 bucks, uh, probably. I don't know. NBA 07. 7. 99. Take it down. Or is it even a, a sticker on it still? Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2, which Need is a good game. Speed. Need for Speed. I mean, that, like crazy expensive. Crazy but, yeah, chuck it over there. 14.99. I'm a Nusha. Oni Musha. Oh, I always mess that up. Sorry, guys. Two. Yeah. Okay. How much is that? Twenty-eight forty-nine. Is that really its value? Samurai's Destiny. It's sealed. New other. So we're new other. Twenty-five. Samurai's Destiny. It's twelve bucks for complete. But yeah, but that's bad. Uh, that, that's one comp. I don't know how that got priced so high. Another. I don't know. Some of the comps are get down. You're you're averaging out somewhere around ten to thirteen. Uh, some of them 15. are with complete getting fifteen. I'd say I'd say knock that down to fifteen because that's way too high. I don't know how that even happened. Also part of the sale. So we'll relist it. Yeah. Pinball Hall of Fame comp this too if it's relevant or not. Gottlieb, eight ninety nine. Just take it down. We're gonna have premium stuff on our whatnot. We, we might not run all of these, or they'll go in our buy it now section on whatnot. Cheap, a lot cheaper than like eight ninety nine. We're not expecting that. Uh, just letting you guys know. If you're like, oh, I don't want to go to this next whatnot show. It's all lame PS two. It's gonna be more than that. This one's eight ninety nine. You want to take it down? Take it down. Then we got these two. Nine ninety nine. That's I, I, this is fine. And Ro Robotech definitely, if it's listed, stays up. There we go. Chuck that over there. And then these go into the list. So these uh, four games, which we're gonna bundle these. Actually, I don't know if any of these. None. All of these were listed. Yeah. Yeah, everything was or listed and some were taken down. Is what I'm getting at. By us. You wanna grab that small stuff? A lot of our PS2, like the, the issue is the best stuff sells first. So like then you get stuck with the slow sellers and lower values. Take it down. It, it, it's honestly condition. I mean, it's not, unpo it, it's a good, it's a decent desk I bet, but Sims. The Sims. Is not listed. Oh, it is it listed. It is listed, but I have it listed as greatest hits, and it's clearly black label. Then we'll just take it down and relist it. Yeah. Sly 3, which is an acceptable price game. It's got to be like 10. Mm -hmm. Not listed. So this has been delisted. Smuggler's Run. Nine ninety nine. We've got SOCOM. We've got three different SOCOM. So we have SOCOM Combined Assault, two. I have Greatest Hits. Sealed. Sealed. Okay, so this is up. Yep, I have SOCOM 2 and SOCOM uh, Combined, Combined Assault. Assault. All right, let's blast through these. Sonic Heroes. Sonic Heroes, Greatest Hits. Spy Hunter. 
It's a red label. Yes. X Squad. X Squad. Ten bucks. The SSX and SSX three. SSX and SSX three. Okay. Uh, Star Trek Shattered Universe, which could become ours. What? I'm just saying. Uh, one simple step. Star Trek Shattered Universe. Okay. And oh, that was it. Yeah, uh, Battlefront. Battlefront PS2 Red Label. Yep. Street Hoops. That one's not listed, but I have pictures of it already. So. Oh, okay. Supercar. Seven dollars. Just get rid of it. It's seven dollars on eBay. We'll probably have it for like two or three and whatnot. Like, and if you buy and get the combined shipping and stuff, like you, we both can benefit pretty greatly on that. Two. Super trucks. Yep. Seven dollars. Take it down. And then we've got siphon filter. The Omega stream. Okay. Uh, we have this Japanese game, uh, Leg Legendia. 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 It's for forty dollars. Mm-hmm. It's just gonna take this forever. This says it's a Japan import. That's yeah. yeah. Okay, that's right. It is a Japanese import game. And then we've got the plan. That's gonna be a real niche sale. Eight dollars. Take it down. If you guys are curious or whatnots, pro underscore picker, and there is a link in the description, you can get $15 Ten for bucks. signing up there. Not 10, 15. 15 on your first purchase. <laughs> yeah. You don't even have to buy it from us. You can buy from anybody that you want. I mean, you could literally right now sign up, get the $15 credit and go spend it somewhere else. Lockdown. Yeah. Road Rage. If it's on, just keep it on because it's a good game. Not on. That's been delisted. Not of no doing of our own. Ty, the Tasmanian Tiger. Yep. Turok Evolution. I, I love the first couple Turok games in 64. I know this isn't that, but still. Just saying. Ultimate Alliance. Ultimate Alliance is a fun game. I played the uh, first one of this for uh, the Xbox 360. Unlimited Saga. Cool uh, Square Enix RPG here. Up. You can take it down if you want. Kmart exclusive, too. All right. So these are going to get relisted for either being taken down by eBay or uh, just because we need to make some alterations and we can't change a lot of uh, like pricing when you have an active sale sometimes so well, i guess the setting when you when you do a sale and i forgot to uncheck the box that's ps2 we're gonna do more later guys let me take this off the little chest about here let me know in the comments if you want to see us go through the bins and when i mean go through the bins check to see if the stuff's still listed on eBay and all of our bins, as well as uh, call some of the lower tier inventory. And just let us know what you, uh, if you want to see that, we can make it happen. It's been uh, kind of interesting. You guys seem to be interested in the whole eBay taking down our listings. I feel like going to the bins would probably be more interesting. Yeah, it would be. I'm going to try. I, I don't know. This will probably be heavily edited. We'll see. Because I'm about to go do that right now. So thanks, guys, for watching. Really do appreciate it. We'll see you in the next video. Make sure to check out the Vlogmas 2023 playlist. And yeah, we'll see you next time. Bye.